Chad and the farm. And today, what are we doing? Gonna get the beefy boys. Picking up the cows. Yeah. The steers. But first, we gotta get a trailer that we borrowed from a friend. So that's what we're doing right now. All right, update time. We're where the beefy boys are. Truck, trailer. And this should be interesting. I don't even see them. Boy, they're pooping a little bit different than they were when I first brought them out here. Can you call them? Say, moo! Come on. First brought them out here, it was like, now it's like, <clears throat> so there's a visual for you. Mm. I think they're back here. Our friend who's been hosting had chickens and his, he got rid of his chickens. So they may be hiding in the little barn the chickens were in. But they're huge, so I don't know where they're at. When it rains, they lay down on the fence rows underneath the trees. There's like five acres out here. And it's pretty, I mean, you guys can see, it's pretty, it's open in the middle. It's pretty, it's like them dogs were coming through that fence. Pretty open in the middle, but the edges are really wooded. Mm. Mm. Right there. Bedded down, then a couple goofy goobers. All right, everybody, this is Case Valley Farms. Got the trailer here, and we, you boys, take them to the house or the farm. As you can see right here. There you go. Mm -hmm. No, I'm pretty stinking excited to get these cows out here. Yeah, we're gonna get some food for the beefy boys. They should go really well. They're, they're grain trained and trailer trained. They should just they should just walk right in the trailer. Yeah. <laughs> yeah just like last time. <coughs> Dad, by the way, is like an expert at uh, getting cows into. <laughs> <laughs> in the trailers. <laughs> yeah. well, a whole lot easier when you just pick them up. Yeah. Come on. How dark they are. And there you have over there the beefy boys. Come on, boys. Come on. Man, I remember a while ago when these guys were literally like brown all the way. He ain't gonna hurt you. He wants it. You gotta open up, buddy. Hey, can you open up for me? Open up. I'm trying to give it to you. <laughs> hold still. Yep. Okay, now hold on to that bottle, man. Hold it up a little higher. What's up, man? What's up? What's up, everybody? You all right? Hi, big buddy. Huh? Come here. Come on, man. Want to get some food? What do you think about that? 
my dad's hand is massive, so you can tell how big this cow is. We're doing, buddy. Look how chunky, chunky. A lot of meat on that one. <laughs> Come on. I'm sorry. My job right now is to get by the gate. That's what I'm gonna do. Come on. Come on, boy. Very easily. Come on. Come on, boy. Come on. Here you have the beefy boys in the back of the trailer eating some nice food, obviously. Some cow feed. See how big these guys are? Alright, well, <laughs> hi, buddy. Alright, well, we're gonna take these guys back to the house. See you then. So guys, we are back at the house. We kind of put the heart before the cow. The heart before the cow. <laughs> the cart before the horse. The cart before the cow. We have cows, yeah. not horses. Yeah. Okay. We need to install a gate. Yep. You need to go this way. Keep going just a smidge more. Yeah. Got the beefy boys in there. Here they are. This is the new red gate that we're gonna put in real fast. Oh wait, that's not a puppy. <laughs> uh, all right, they're, they're the beefy boys. Sorry, I'm trying not to film the bars. I'm filming through the thing. But there they are. We're gonna, ins we kind of put the, we kind of put the, uh, how would I say this? The cow before the, the cow before the gate? Yeah, we needed the gate and uh, we got the cows first. So dad has to go install one. 
and they, they're they okay in there. They're gonna go chill, right? They can chill, they're fine. This is the moment we've been waiting for for how long? Oh man, months. Months, yeah, we've been waiting to get these beefy boys into this big old pasture. All right. We've been waiting though. Yeah, it's been, we've been waiting for these guys because, man, they're just so cool. Uh, just for safety though, if you stand over there. Yeah, I'm, I was really hoping you would say that. Are we sure they can't get out anywhere? Oh, they didn't check. I guess we'll know here in a little bit. Yep. Yeah. See it? Here they are in there. Come on, boy. Come on, baby boys. Come on, everybody. Come on. Come on, cow. Come on. Come on. I'll get, get you guys some zoom in action so you can see what's going on a little better. I'll let him take your time. I don't want to. Yeah, you don't want to push him. We've done so much today. I don't really want to get kicked in the last five minutes of the video. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Come on, guys. So is it crazy to see them? Because, like, their brown is coming off. They're all black now. Yeah. yeah. I haven't seen them in a while, but... Man, these guys... Oh, they look so beastly. Come on, boy. I mean, they're pretty, pretty chunky, too. So, I hope you guys can hear me. I don't mean to yell, but we cowboy cut brisket. You know what that means. We pinned him on the ground, and we castrated him. Ribeye, we banned it probably two months ago. And apparently, I haven't been paying very good attention because they're still there and the band is gone <laughs> and the cojones are not so we have a bull and a steer which means we need a heifer yeah oh what's up big boy what's up buddy what's up man this is crazy. It's been so long. Look at this behemoth of a What's creature. Up, buddy? Now, if they go by, you just let them go. Okay. Come towards daddy. Back up. Look. He's digging into the grass. He's already eating it. You getting that brisket? Ribeye, come here, man. Your best friend's, your best friend's enjoying this. My goodness, he's it's like a vacuum cleaner. Oh. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. He's coming in. Hey. Good job, buddy. Dun, 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 dun. Look at them big old horns. Coming out the top of his head. He's scary looking. <laughs> Back up a little bit. <laughs> and, of course, here, let me zoom out for you guys a little bit. Got all of this land. And this is the, and this isn't zoomed out to make it bigger either. I mean, this is all big. Over there is a possible thing for later. I'm not going to reveal anything yet. But check out the beefy boys. Here they are. Already grazing on everything good out of here. So, yeah. Here they are. We really like it because, man, we just, we've been waiting for so long. It's so cool seeing these guys out here. You can hear them tearing up the grass. We should just put one out up front and just, boom, new lawnmower. <laughs> what do you think? I'm super excited. I mean, this is really cool. 
you go. You got double chomping grass. <laughs> it's kind of funny because soon a lot of this is going to be gone. But that's why there's so much of it. I mean, look at all this grass just everywhere for them. And I'm super pumped for this. It's going to be an awesome adventure with the beefy boys. I mean, look at that. That's just, that's just so cool. Pet one if I could, but now at this age, you can't pet him. <laughs> Yeah, you could pet ribeye. Yeah, by by himself later. Yeah. Cause. But brisket kind of guards ribeye. It's actually pretty cool. He's he's bigger, and I think he knows. So yeah. Also, cows are incredibly smart. So it's so cool. All right, what you think, man? Super excited because we got the baby boys out here. Finally. Oh man. You gotta fight for your right to party. I'm gonna move Where are you going? That wasn't that embarrassing? Yeah, it kinda was. <laughs> you don't even know, man. I nailed that note. Thanks for watching, guys. The Beefy Boys are content and we tucked them in for bed. So make sure you subbed and hit that notification bell. Deuces.